Hi, this is Sarah with She Never Slept, and I'm here with Ben Pemblesmith. Say hi, Ben. Hi, Ben. Yes. Um, so you're here at the Heroes Con. How many years have you come to the event here in North Carolina? This is my third one. Uh, I was invited to four, though. I just missed one accidentally. That was last year, right? Nope. Year before. Year before. Okay. So um, what are you working on now? What are your most recent projects? I uh, just did a book. I am doing a book called Ten Grand with JMS. Joe Michael Suzinski. It's doing rather well. Uh, it's from Image called 10 Grand. Uh, best sales of my life, I think. Uh, I will slowly be starting to work on some fell again, maybe, and prodding Warren about doing some more too. Uh, and I have, uh, we're about to launch Tome 2 after the wildly successful first Kickstarter we did last year for Tome. Tome is a big art book uh, collection of the premier artists in the world for dark art sort of thing. Uh, that's coming up in the next two weeks from 44 Flood, which is a company I helped form. Um, and I have a lot of other stuff I can't really talk about yet. Yeah, that's always the way, isn't it? Um, well, I don't talk about things until I've actually got them underway, like creatively speaking. Because otherwise I'm just blowing smoke up my own ass, you know? Yes. I'm broke, yeah. So, um, what got you inspired to start working in the comics industry? I like to tell stories. You don't choose comics, comics choose you simple as that and your style varies greatly is there anything that you oh, thank you I, most people say it's all the same so. <laughs> well I don't think so <laughs> I think okay. it I think it does vary um, what is your particular uh, favorite way to are you do you like doing black and whites do you do your own coloring I do everything I'm an artist so I just create a piece from beginning to end so you do the penciling the inking and everything well, yeah, it, for me, it's an organic process. There's no production line mentality of penciling, inking, coloring. It's, although I do do it usually in that order, but yeah, I just, I just create a piece of art. I don't fit the normal mechanical nuts and bolts um, process where you have to have multiple people doing a book because that's the, way, the only way you'll get the thing done in time. So I just do everything. I'm, apparently, I'm quick enough, and I like my own vision. You've worked with a lot of great writers. Is there any favorite? That's don't an want to put question. you on the spot. That's an unfair <laughs> question. I like working with them all. You do. I work with friends or people who become friends. You end up staying friends with a lot of the people yeah. that you work with. Yeah, but That's um, great. I'd say uh, working with Warren Ellis was my wet dream. So was it? I, I can cross that off my. I have no ambition anymore. I've, I've you worked have no with Warren. No bucket list. There isn't anyone else that you no. would like go. Uh, it's just whoever comes along. Yeah. I couldn't knock back working with JMS because I grew up with Babylon 5. Yeah, oh yeah, absolutely. Uh, I don't know him from his comics, so which you might hate, but I don't know. No, but, I uh, like Jay Michael. He's, he's I jumped really at the nice. chance, so yeah. Um, so our website deals with science fiction, horror, strange tales. That seems to be something that you really enjoy. Do you know, can you remember when... Dark science fiction is my favorite genre. So. Can you remember when it first sort of grabbed you? Probably when I saw The Thing or Aliens when I was a teenager late at night on TV. No. I'm like, what the hell's up with that? So, yeah, it, it stuck. Well, the thing would be like, what the hell's up with that? Yeah. Do you like um, Lovecraft? We have a lot of Lovecraft. I'm not fans. really that familiar with Lovecraft. Mm -hmm. I love the mythos and the visuals for it. Mm -hmm. And I love Dagon. I want to adapt Dagon one day, maybe. But that I'm not, but I'm not in any way an aficionado on his literature, uh, which a lot of people assume I am, but I'm not. I just like tentacles. You like and tentacles? I love them. I love everything that is drawn from that mythos. So I see the pop culture around it more than him himself. Uh, he was kind of a creep and a bigot, so. Yeah, he kind of was. But yeah, yeah. But yeah, yeah. But came so, up with some really brilliant ideas. Yeah, I like do, the mythos. As do some bigots. But I'm, I'm in no way an expert on his stuff. So. Yeah. Well, um, is there any. Uh, you guys did a Kickstarter project for the first one. Are you doing a Kickstarter project for the second book? The second what book? The uh, one you were speaking about earlier. Tome? Tome? Yes. Yeah. Yes. The Kickstarter will start in about two weeks or so. Okay. Uh, and where can they look out for that? On Facebook? or 44flood.com. Facebook with 44flood. Uh, everywhere on the internet, hopefully. Me, Twitter stream, uh, Templesmith. Uh, everywhere, pretty much. Well, thank you so much for spending some time with us today. Thank you. And um, that's it. Bye, science.